<laughs> Good morning, everybody. Okay, where am I? This is word for Wednesday, you guys. Let me show the back. You know when you see steps like this, that means you're downtown and I'm at the court building. So words for wisdom while I walk back to my car is handle your business. <laughs> and why do I say handle your business? So today I finally decided to go to court because, and, I, and usually I don't share my business with people. I'm a very private person actually, but I'm thinking maybe this can help somebody today. I had tickets, and when I mean I had tickets, I had quite a few tickets, you guys. I had so many tickets, they turned into warrants, if I'm not mistaken, but when I went to the window and finally did the payment plan, um, she said that I didn't have warrants. So I'm thinking that they got, let's see, let me go like this and let this lady pass me. Um, they went away because I decided to come to court and take handle my business today. So, true story, I'll just tell you a little tidbit. Earlier this year, guess who went to jail? That would be me, Aisha the Egg Girl. Never been to jail before, never really been in trouble before, but I had other tickets. And um, it was a different part, I'll just say it's, it was in Henderson. Henderson doesn't play, so if you live in Las Vegas, you guys know about Henderson, they do not play. Um, so I went to jail, did not like that at all just saying wasn't in there long but um it was a big wake-up call for me for the simple fact that i should have been handled those tickets and i wouldn't probably had to go to jail i'm just saying but like i said it was a wake-up call so i set up a lot of payment arrangement or i set up a payment arrangement and handled that now when i decided um i had to do something at the dmv and all my old tickets came out of nowhere <laughs> And I should actually let me take personal uh, responsibility. They didn't come out of nowhere. They've been there and I just ignored them. So um, I decided to get take them taken care of. How many tickets did I have you guys? I'll be honest with you. Like I said, I usually don't share my business, but I had like seven tickets you guys. Seven tickets. <laughs> and at one point, some of them had to turn into warrants you guys. And um, but like I said, I took care of them today. And let me tell you something. The only reason why I took care of them today was so close to Thanksgiving. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving. So I was taking a big risk of being possibly arrested. But as you can see, I'm walking to my car now making this video. Is because someone posted online. And I'm, I'm kind of, I was going to say I'm mad. But I'm not mad at the person that did it. Whoever posted whatever they did online. Because I saw it somewhere and I screenshotted it and put it on my Facebook page asking for some information and nobody can answer the questions for me so when I went into court today they said they didn't know what I was talking about so whoever posted that I'm not mad but then I am kind of mad because actually it made me take personal responsibility today and actually get this taken care of before it could have got a lot worse because Lord knows if I was ever to be pulled over and the cop was really on a good one, I would have went to jail. So with that being said, yeah, um, it works for Wednesday, you guys. Handle your business. Now here's the thing, big shout out to my mentor slash teacher slash family member. <laughs> I mentioned that, yeah, I had some warrants. He goes, yeah, you need to get to take getting those taken care of. So they are all taken care of. I got put on a payment plan. For all of you guys that are I don't know struggling with something and or me it was just tickets and um, you're afraid to go in and get it taken care of just get it taken care of because you know what at the end it could end up in jail <laughs> that's one or something worse so super happy that I took care of that today now I'm not riding around dirty I guess you can say right just saying because I love to roll as you guys know, I love a good deal, and I love to just get in the car and go. So with that being said, you guys, words for Wednesday. Excuse me, I'm walking and it's warm. Words for Wednesday, handle your business, just saying. All right, you guys, I'm at my car, and you know what? You know what I'm famous for, you guys, right? A nap, I need a nap. All right, I hope somebody found something in there. But yeah, like I said, I usually don't share my business, but I'm just saying, it, it really, I'm glad whoever posted that online, made me think to come down here and just handle my business and handle what I should have handled well over a year ago. Some of these tickets were from 2007, you guys. It is now 2017, I'm just saying. That's how old some of these tickets were. But with that being said, yeah, if you guys got something that you've been putting on the back burner and you're just afraid to do it, just 
look bite the bullet and do it all right you guys everybody have an amazing day